match day nine of the 2021-2022 Bet King Ethiopian Premier League is uh, gathering momentum at the Awasa University Stadium. Good evening to you and welcome to a battle between Dredawa up against Addis Ababa Ketema. It is Zemaria Molde Gyogis against Atekin Kobench that is without Demesu Fekadu this evening who finds himself ill. The injured goalkeeper Daniel Cheshome takes charge. Then Musa, he's got support, you know, Enya Ukasa won! Penalty! The referee has pointed to the penalty spot. The right back, Enyeo Kesaun, had a big marauding run from his own back four. Rushed into the area. Uh, the referee suggesting there was infringement. Dredawa having an early chance to take the lead here in Hawasa. And Dale Kabede goes into the referee's book. Mohedin Musa steps forward. Here he comes, right footed. Musa! It's in! Wakene Adunya! Sent the wrong way as Mohedin Musa opens the scoring for Dredawa. The side from the city of love with love in Hawasa. Mohedin Musa took his time, picked his rightful spot, ensured the goalkeeper has made a move to his left. Here comes Adisa Baba, twisting and turning, running into the area for Fitzum, who struck this one with Venom. And uh, Dereje Alemu almost spilled that one into the path of Richmond Adongo. Good run by Fitzum, good shot there. And of course, the uh, suspect man should be Dereja Alemu. That ball looked a little bit weak. He dropped it, but he was quick to recover. Powerful in the midfield, bring one into the area. Big touch, big save from Dereja. There's a return ball in there, and he picks it up again. Fits from Tilaun and Richmond Adongo, where the two are disabled players inside that box. What a cross from Charles Ribano. Are oh, we talking about that space right behind the back four? Again, poor clearance there. Good head, and they are coming in for Prisome. Again, good shot stopped there by Dereja Alemu. Comes back to Richmond Adongo with a good left foot. But this one now brings Dereja Alemu into the game. That finds his side in a tricky situation as well as we look at a big defensive mix up. The goalkeeper has picked this one at the edge of the area. Zerion and Shebo was trying to return this one to Wakene Adunya, who sees red. And it's an early shower, a huge defensive mix up in Daniel Teshoma's side. They're already a goal down, and now they're a man down. Wakene Adunya rushed off his line, and he had no idea Zeri Hunan Shebo was returning this ball to him. Referee is watching what's happening inside the area. This is brought in well, and there was a crucial touch almost coming off Lemene Tadese, a big center half, almost having a touch on this one, and that could have uh, troubled Dereje Alemu. It's a big chance for Issa Disababa's side. Oh, good, good delivery by, by Petros Asegeny. Looking at this, so bring this one in, looking for Fitzomo at the touch, and he just didn't have enough power to trouble the Reje. They're living dangerously. It's a good cross there from Adisu. And Neil, you are a defender. He's marking him from the back. Again, Fitzum just sneaks in and drops the ball, but it really didn't have power. This is allowed to bounce for Fitzum, who brings it into the area, and he's looking for anyone in blue. And Henoke Sayas cleared this one perfectly well. He was under pressure from Endale Kebede. Uh, the left back standing firm and clearing this one just right, not to try and trouble the Reje Alemu. Goalkeeper not being able to come out, but the left back Enoch Asaya just coming at the nick of time. Hitting Birukel Bore to reach Monadongo, who is trying to rush into shooting space, fouled by Mohamed Abdurretif, who was on a yellow card, and that will be red. So it's 10 up against 10. Uh, seen the referee produce the second red card of the game. Rightly so. It is right. It's 10 against 10. You have the green light. Emene Tadese, one of those standing over it. Mulukena Desu, the other. This is Mulukena Desu taking a short one out wide. It was very well watched by uh, the Dread our side. And he's asking for a return free kick. The referee did not see that infringement because Mulukena Desu was trying to have a return shot and uh, there seemed to have been an open boot just on him but the referee was looking away well it's something that he was trying it's an open boot that is an open boot clear open boot it should have been a foul it should have been retaken uh, it's the full-time whistle zamaria molde georges has beaten daniel Teshome, the standing tactician for today's game full-time trade have beaten adisa babaketema by a goal to nil